Hello, hi, and namaste, or welcome to this channel. I hope you have watched the first video of Kobo Toolbox where we have learned about creating a basic form. Uh, now, in this video, I will show you how to deploy a form to the Kobo Collect app, a powerful data collection tool. So, let's get started. In my screen, you have seen I have created a form, I have deployed the form, uh, and now I want uh, the data collectors to start collecting the data in the Kobo toolbox. So for that, uh, just go down and here you could see collect data now the by default it's on online offline multiple submission. Just click on it and drag it little down so the last option android application use this option to collect data in the field with your android device just click on this select this option now you will be given a list of steps to carry out in order to collect the data so first you need to install kobo collect app on your android device you need to click on settings then you need to enter url username and password uh, get blank form and select this project uh, so now i will show you my screen so for this open your play store and type in kobo collect here kobo collect okay then this blue tick one is the one which we are going to install install this app okay we have installed the app let's open this now we have two options configured with qr code manually enter project details we don't have the qr code right now so we will go with the second option that is manually entering or uh, configuring with the server click on this manually enter project details now we will be redirected to this screen so url is the one that you have been this one is the url which we need to type as it is and the username is like in my account if i click on this this easy tech support is my username so i'll enter that here easy tech support and the password that i use to log into kobo toolbox account so enter here Add. okay password saved like we have configured it the next step is now we have to get the blank form or we need to fetch the forms that we have deployed in our account so click on get blank form text time wait for a few seconds but now we have only one form so i will just click on it then we are selecting only one if you have five then you can select whichever you want so i have selected this on the right corner bottom right corner we have get selected option click on it then all downloads succeeded okay now we will start filling up the form fill blank form click on the form i give consent yes full name let's write test age let's write 56 gender female dob let's select a random one for now email contact number so that we have grade let's write six now subjects english maths and are you involved in any yes let's just fill in okay gps coordinates while using the app for now i will save it but for the real data it should be below five meter next thank you for filling up the form next then i will click on save form and exit then if you want to make any changes just click on edit save form click on the form then you can like i have made the groups so wherever you want to edit you can just simply click on it and save this form after you are done with all the update or editing the data now it's time to send the data so just click on this send finalized form button then select the form 
and click on the option send selected which is situated on the bottom right corner send selected if i go to the like first interface then i see like we have nothing for edit save form and send finalized form as you have already sent so we can view the sent form and for the next of data to fill up again you need to go with this and again you can fill up all the details initially i had no data but if i refresh this i should be able to get the data now see june 12 2023 yes taste everything i can also view the reports to download the data you simply have to go on download tab then click on export and click on export type date language included groups no multiple version yes now just click on after clicking on export your file will be ready so click on the download button after this if we open this file see you can see the data as okay this is how it looks like i hope now you will be able to collect data using your android device using the kobo collect app uh, i hope you will not be having any issues with the configuring with the kobo server if you have any issues please don't forget to write it in the comment section below uh, stay tuned i'll be back with the next video soon till then take care bye bye